One of the most haunting images from the Palisades fire was the rows of cars abandoned on the streets as people tried to evacuate. Some were left to burn. Cleaning up some of what was stayed behind, like the lithium batteries in electric vehicles, now are a priority for the EPA. Eyewitness News reporter Josh Haskell has the details. Within the destruction of homes and businesses located in the Eden and Palisades fire zones lies hazardous waste like lithium ion batteries. When these rechargeable batteries that are used in everything from electric vehicles to home energy storage catch fire or are exposed to high heat, something called a thermal runaway event takes place that poses a threat to human health. There's a lot of energy in there. A thermal runaway event is an unintended chemical reaction within the battery itself. So they do create a, a, a toxic and harmful and potentially uh, flammable and explosive atmosphere when they when they fail. Which is why phase one of the EPA's cleanup of the Palisades and Eden fires is focused on locating and properly disposing of things like lithium ion batteries. First, a reconnaissance team locates the lithium ion batteries using information obtained through permitting or from homeowners who call the EPA's hotline. Then recovery teams bring the batteries to this staging area for the Palisades fire located near Topanga and PCH. Battery cells that could still ignite are wrapped in fire blankets and batteries that still have charge are de-energized in a brine solution. Then they're crushed by this compactor. This method to render safe lithium ion batteries was developed at the Maui wildfire response, recreating it for the Palisades and Eden fires is the largest wildfire mobilization that the EPA has ever conducted. So as we ship them back out to the communities and we put them on the freeways, right, to these final uh, disposal places, uh, they're safe. And that's really our biggest goal here is safety. It's public safety, it is environmental safety. So far, the EPA has removed 200 lithium ion batteries from electric vehicles. In Malibu, Josh Haskell, ABC 7 Eyewitness News. Hello, I'm Mark Brown. Get more great ABC7 content by clicking the subscribe button for our YouTube channel and download the ABC7 Los Angeles streaming app on Fire TV, Android TV, Apple TV, and Roku to watch on your TV.